Milan, baby girl, baby girl, please don't kill Carrion. I like him. Oh shit, he dead. Hey guys, it's your girl Tiffany and welcome back to my channel. If you're enjoying my that time I got reincarnated at this slime reactions, please remember to like the video, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell icon that's next to it because that alerts you when a new video has been posted. Also check out the description below because that you can find the link to the slime reaction playlist. You can also find links to my other socials so you can drop me some support over there as well. And I need you to leave your comments in the comment section. Uh, guys, by doing everything that I've just listed, this lets YouTube know that you're enjoying my content. Therefore, they'll push it out more. So guys, you got three episodes from me. Never in your life have you guys got a three episodes of back to back to back of slime from me. Or any other series I've ever done back to back episodes. Well, I'm not going to the times that when I went on holidays and had to catch up with everything. I'm not going to those. I mean, like, just generally. Because these last two episodes was the best episodes of the season. Hell, the best episodes of Slime ever. Ever. I said it. It was just phenomenal. It, it was beautiful as well with the different how, um, I don't know if we should call us Sage anymore or Words of the World. We'll see what they say was going through the transformation of Remaru coming from a slime to a demon race slime, eventually turning him to the demon lord. We had Kuru, one hell of a butler, is here. Oh dear, I wonder if you guys say Kuru or Diablo. I know which one he's going to go with. But anywho, he's here and he wants to be in the servitude of Remaru. So that's going to be a very interesting dynamic. I feel like he's going to bring an interesting dynamic because it's gonna be funny if he tries to insert himself as his right hand man, which is uh, is Benamaru's position. So it's gonna be funny if he's gonna try to do that, or is he just happy to just be a subordinate? It's gonna be interesting. Shion is back from the dead um, with the magic the magic cues that they had used in the protection protection of the shield, along with Diablo's. Um, I don't know what they were. What they were. Are the demons of Diablo's subordinates? There was enough magic use to create a to bring Shion and the rest of them back to life. Uh, we've had uh, prisoners of war. So we had we have the king, the archbishop, and Razin. And Grisius made a very interesting statement. He said, "Because Ramu is bringing someone back to life, that's something even." What's his name? Carazon has it done and he's a demon lord. So it's going to be interesting to see where Remaru ranks in terms of demon lord. I know he's definitely higher than Clayman, but in terms of the others such as Melum, Carazon, um, I'm guessing the um, Shizu's own is still wrong. Impairs where does he lie, especially now that he has the arch demon on his side. Is he the only demon lord with an arch demon on his side or do everybody else have or do some other demon lords have it it's going to be interesting to see where this story goes but i feel like this episode kind of ends the arc before we go into a new one so that's why i want to finish it so we're going on to episode uh, 12 of season 2 and this is episode 36 the one unleashed with that being said, let's jump into this episode. バレバレは今この瞬間をもって敵の殲滅行動に移る。リムル様。リムル様が魔王になった時に理性が残っているかどうかを確かめるためにああいう言葉を決めておきませんか。ああいう言葉を決めておきませんか。ああいう言葉を
やり遂げましょう。That is your right hand man. Yes. Right hand Kiju. Okay, he songs normal. I like that her design change as well. She's huge! She is oh. back! Oh! 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 Yes, never make us worry again. Okay, he seems normal. How? I've been giving gifts. They evolved! No, you didn't. <laughs> no, no, she lied. <laughs> Raphael, okay. Because she's an angel. This is so cute. <laughs> oh, she's sticking to that. She's gonna stick with that. Leave it alone. Uh oh. ネンのためですが、魔王となったリムル様にちゃんと。シオンの料理は。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そう。いいな、そ
That is true. But wow. Yeah, I feel like he's the most friendliest of the demon lords we face. If an exception of Remoro. Oh, bitch, this still going. Yeah, that's the only thing I could think of. Oh, he looks sick. That is a dope design. Oh, Yep, that was Milam in her dra in the dragon story. Milam looks sick too. I actually like this design of Milam. Now why her comeback armor got more <laughs> more clothes? But okay. Uh-uh. Milam? Milam? Milam, baby girl, baby girl, please don't kill carry on. I like him. Oh shit, he dead. Woo! Melum! Melum! Melum. You're wrong for that. Yeah, I think Melum might be the most powerful demon lord. ちょっとして。ゆっくりと聞かせてほしいわね。スカイクリーン<笑> Demon Lord Frey. I'm guessing that's a, a new demon lord in the Because what was the queen's name? I'm sure it wasn't Frey. Towards us. Oh, 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 Running shit! Sophia! Sit up! Katakuchi,全員で攻め込みますよ。あ、待て、お前たち。俺の考えでは魔王カリオンは生きている。リムが決闘を邪魔されて怒らないわけがない。だからお前たちは勝手に暴走するなよ。協力しないと助けられるもの
Oh Jesus. Be a fans. Oh Lord. No, what are you gonna call him? Diablo! Diablo! Oh, he gonna sleep for three days! Oh, Jesus! Oh, the that's okay! Oh lord, I'm scared. I'm hell of a butler! I'm gonna call him hell of a butler! It fits! Sebastian! You have composition! Sebastian! Oh yeah, these bombs. Oh yeah. Why? Kotaime Veldora coming back in this bitch. <laughs> I was calling this man Diablo just because he's the devil, not knowing that that's gonna be his name. Oh, Veldora! Yes, good boy. Uh oh, don't get jealous now. You got to. He always on top of it. Yes. Yeah, that's right. We gave Veldora how much little oh, shit. Is he taller? He is. Ah, Veldora's gonna get a body body. You still ain't got no. You still genderless. Don't do that. Are we gonna see Veldor in this episode? Don't cut it off, cause I, I can't watch no more. Veldor! Uh oh. He's getting bigger. Veldor is blonde? Oh la Vildora. <laughs> that was a perfect end to that little arc. It really was. So I Veldora might take over Benamaru's spot because we, we, we all know Benamaru's gonna die now after eating what Shion said. As you see, Shion said he she he's no longer Benamaru Sama. It's just Benamaru. So I'm guessing Veldora is gonna take over Benamaru's spot as being my baby because he, he ain't gonna live. He not gonna live. Even if he's poison resistant, the fact that she's alive. The fact that she's extra mad, the, the, the cooking gonna be worse. So yeah, I lost my baby Ben Benmaru. Um, thank a God, Remaru is still the same Remaru. None has changed, just in terms of power scaling, and he has grown taller. So that is the only thing that changed. He is still the same old Remaru that we adore. We still have some issues to deal with. We gotta figure out what in God's blazes Clemens. Um, well, plan is because he now has Frey and he has Milum seeming to be working with him. We still have Falmon to deal with. We have the church to deal with, but as 
Raphael stating, with Veldora coming back, that's going. We won't have to deal with the church now because Veldora presence alone is going to deter them from doing anything to the um to Tempest. We have Diablo. Now I was calling him Diablo because I'm sure that's what they called him before. If I'm not wrong, it was also because it means devil. So I know that's what it means. I didn't actually know that was his name. I know his name was Koro. I know that's what we were calling him before. Because Koro means black. And he's an arch demon. But <laughs> he over here became Sebastian. He's one hell of a butler. Who knew? I was just saying that because he, he was acting but like a subordinate. That's the only reason I was making that joke. Not to know that he's actually going to become a butler like. Oh my god. And he wanted head pass. My man was, was so tight with Ranga getting his little rubs. He's like, Lord, I didn't see that coming from Koro, but I feel like Koro is going to be an interesting entity in all little dynamic we have for the fact that he's an arch demon and the fact that he is a willingly following Romaru and he now has a name, which makes him even more stronger. And we have Veldora back. It's going to be hilarious with this Sundari back. But it's gonna be even more hilarious now that he has a body, and I like the fact that he's not gonna look like Remaru because I was a little scared because he was using Remaru that he would come out looking like Remaru. No, he's bl he looks like a younger version of Carry On. That's what he looks like. So it's gonna be very interesting with Vildora back in the mix. Is how it's gonna go because technically Veldora was the goblin's protector. How are they going to act now that their previous protector is now back with their protector that is Ramaru? So that's going to be very interesting. These three episodes have been fabulous. I enjoyed myself with these three um, episodes from giddiness to being people being destroyed to Falma being destroyed to happiness that Shion is here to happiness again with the crew being the crew again to excitement to knowing what the hell is going to happen and tell me why <laughs> Milam looked more badass with clothes on than she did with clothes off like she looked even she looked better when she was in her armor than she does when she was she in her normal looks that was fire but it's gonna be very interesting to see how this goes this i guess will be second half of season two i feel like the fire is there so but it's gonna be very very interesting to see how they play this second half going so with that being said if you enjoy my reaction please remember to like the video hit that subscribe button leave your comments in the comment section guys a like a sub a comment a share of this video goes a long way in expanding this channel and i thank you guys so much for your support i'll see you guys in the next episode bye